It's been five years since fans of the Animal Crossing series were graced with a new installment to their beloved franchise. Although there was Welcome Amiibo Update and that other game, fans have been yearning for a new Animal Crossing game for quite some time, and could this be the year they get their wish? Well, I'm your host 24 Kevin here for 24 Kevin Tendo, and these are all the Animal Crossing rumors you need to know before E3. Before the last Nintendo Direct, Nintendo fans began to speculate that a new Animal Crossing would be announced after Nintendo modified the official Animal Crossing website. They added in a news and video section that have since been removed. Granted, all the links led to placeholders including a trailer for Breath of the Wild and another showing text for Frank Kafka's The Metamorphosis, while the 3DS website has also gone completely haywire since this changed. Nothing has been updated since this initial change, so one would have to think they're waiting for a new announcement before doing any further updates. Since the release of Animal Crossing Pocket Camp, there had been rumors surrounding Nintendo compatibility with Animal Crossing. With the recent addition of Nintendo Switch's in-game, fans have started to theorize that this would in fact point to an Animal Crossing port. This was also indicated a long time ago when Nintendo revealed that they would like to have some compatibility between their mobile titles and Switch titles. And with the recent reveal of Pokemon Let's Go adding in compatibility between Pokemon Go and Pokemon Let's Go, then Nintendo could announce a new Animal Crossing at E3 with compatibility with their mobile title, which could include some in-game items being transferred over. People would instantly download Animal Crossing just to get those items in-game, and would probably help push Animal Crossing's mobile downloads to the top of the charts. There was also the leaky leaks from Vergeben, who's been known for leaking details of games, did state that Animal Crossing was in development and would be released in Q3, which would put it in line with Nintendo's online services. Whether or not this is a reliable source this time is debatable, but Verge does at least seem to have some sources in the industry, so there could be some validity to this. And finally, not too long ago Nintendo trademarked a bunch of IPs including Animal Crossing back in January. What's interesting is Nintendo made the patent for home and mobile devices, but granted they have been worded similarly in the past, but with Nintendo Switch being a portable and home console hybrid, this could indicate a Switch port is in the works. Especially since games seem to pop up a few months after the trademarks have been filed, so that Nintendo gives people a chance to forget that they had been filed in the first place. Again, this is all speculation and I've been calling for a new Animal Crossing game for years, but I really think this is going to be the year. And that's all the time we got for today's episode, sorry there weren't more rumors or indications of an Animal Crossing port coming. At this point, everything online is just speculation and hope, but I truly believe we will be getting it this year. For everyone here at 24 Kevin Tendo, I'm your host 24 Kevin. See you guys next time, hope you had a great day. Bye!